In Columbia County, where deputies are trying to determine if a Lake City man will face more charges after the child he's accused of abusing died. Baby's death comes about 24 hours after it was brought to the hospital for help. Channel 4's Kamasi Aaron's on her way to Lake City right now, joins us by phone. What do we know about the situation, Kamasi? Well, Bruce, the baby died last night on its first birthday, one day after being brought to the hospital unconscious. Now it's going to be up to the state attorney's office to determine what this means for the man who is accused of abusing this child. That man is 23-year-old Dwight Tyre III. Now, the third, excuse me. According to deputies, he was the last person to see this child. And when deputies interviewed him, he revealed to them that his actions caused the baby's injuries. Tyre was charged with aggravated assault aggravated child abuse and felony battery before the baby died. According to the police report, medical staff said that the child had injuries that were consistent with the shaken baby syndrome. The Columbia County Sheriff's Office said he may face some additional charges after um, he is accused of abusing this child. He's in the Columbia County Detention Facility right now being held without bond. The child would have turned one year old yesterday, but Tuesday, the child was brought to Lake City Medical Center unresponsive. He had to be transferred to UF Health in Gainesville. Investigators interviewed the baby's mother, released her to be with the child at the hospital where that baby died. Detectives searched the family's home and the vehicle on Wednesday, and an autopsy is being conducted right now to determine the exact cause and manner of death. Again, we are on the way to Lake City to speak with officials. We will have a full report on this tonight on the news at 5. Back to you.